So today we're going to talk about the arteries of the tongue. The arteries of the tongue are quite easy to understand. I'm going to draw it out quickly first and then we can label them together to understand where they go. So the external carotid artery, which goes up the neck, gives off many vessels. The first vessel it gives off is the superior thyroid artery. The second vessel it gives off is the lingual artery. This is one we're interested in as it's the main supply of the tongue. The third artery it gives off is the facial artery. It's important to know that the lingual artery comes off between the superior th thyroid artery and the facial artery. One of the main branches that comes off the lingual artery is the dorsal lingual artery. It provides blood supply to the root of the tongue and it also gives a branch which goes to the palatine tonsil. Another important branch that comes off the lingual artery is the deep lingual artery. It supplies the body and the apex of the tongue. The sublingual arteries are at the end of the lingual artery and it supplies numerous branches to the floor of the mouth and the sublingual glands. Some literature will mention that there's a second smaller blood supply to the tongue, the tonsillar branch of the facial artery. and also the ascending pharyngeal artery. However, it is a much smaller supply than the lingual artery as they are mainly for supplying the tonsils in that region and also the pharynx. The ascending pharyngeal artery also supplies the palatoglossus, which if you've watched the first video about the anatomy of the tongue, you know that the palatoglossus is one of the extrinsic muscles of the tongue. So I'm now going to draw on the tongue just to give you more of an idea about where the branches of the lingual artery actually go so you can picture it in your head. So that's the tongue there and the deep lingual artery which goes up to supply the apex. The deep lingual artery has many smaller branches that comes off it which go up into the tongue. The dorsal lingual artery also extends up to the root of the tongue. The dorsal lingual artery also supplies some branches to the tonsils. The first branch of the lingual artery is actually the suprahyoid branch of the lingual artery. However, it runs along the upper border of the hyoid bone and supplies blood to the muscles attached to it as opposed to the tongue itself. I hope this video has been useful for you and please do go and try some of the quizzes to see how much you've learned.